Hi friends, Miss Ellie here. We're going to do a craft project of where do you live? Now it's just very, really simple. Here I did one just to show you. This is a house and this is a building. I live in an apartment building. And you see all these windows? They all belong to other people. Mine is down here on the first floor. Where's yours? Do you live in a house? Do you live in an apartment? Let's see. So some shapes that you can use for the house are a square, little small squares, a rectangle. This would be where my flowers go because I would have a little flower pot and this triangles for the roof, a rectangle for the building and tiny little squares for the windows and a rectangle, a small rectangle for the door. And in this picture, it's nighttime. You see the moon and you see the yellow, the, the yellow ones here, that's stars. And here's a tree and here it says, where do you live? Where do you live? So, just a quick way to do it would be, get a paper and you take your shapes, pre-cut of course, you take, you can start with whatever you'd like. Your rectangle for your apartment, your square for your house, and your triangle. And you just put it on like so. And then, of course, your windows, which Miss Ellie needs a few more because I use them all. And then you would encourage the child to just glue, 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 and put on as much as they can. Today, I don't have my happy helpers because they are busy watching Disney shows. <laughs> so, we're going to do this together, you and me. This door is too big. So, just a quick activity to show a house. See? And then you would show the children how to place the shapes just so this way they can get an idea. And then when they see it, then you can move it away and you can add some glue and they can just put it on. And then you take this and you add some glue and they put it on and you just keep going until you have it all set up the way you would like. Oh, see, he's always making a mess, but that's okay. Sometimes messes happen. And it's okay if they only have three pieces on. It's okay if they have all of them on like I did. It's okay if they're crooked. It's okay if it's not on the way exactly how you did it. The door could be sideways. The roof could be off to the corner. And that's okay. Why? Because everybody's homes are different. Like here's one that I took my time and I put together. And here's one that would probably be what our kids would do. And that's okay. Just have fun while you do it, friends. Bye-bye. Where do you live?